Michigan State and Penn State. I'm going to go on and pull it up on the screen here. Um, Michigan State is an 18-point underdog on the road. The total sits at 52.5. Of course, that was an ugly, ugly loss to Indiana last week, who had lost seven straight games before they got the win over the Spartans. Uh, The total sits at 52.5 over at BetUS, uh, 4 p.m. Eastern time on FS1. That is what this one has been relegated to. This was an ABC game last year, and now this thing is on FS1 because of how bad Michigan State has been. Penn State uh, favored by 18. Over the past five weeks, my numbers show that Penn State should be favored by 28 points. 28. That is insane. Uh, And I'm going to listen to it. I'm going to tell you. I'm going to take Penn State minus the 18 here. And the reasoning for that. You look at PPA margin, Penn State is number seven over the past five weeks. Uh, And that that does include a game against Ohio State. Uh, Michigan State is number 109. Uh, Michigan State is number 96 in offensive PPA per drive, number 109 in defensive PPA per drive. Penn State is number 32 in offensive PPA per drive and number 12 in defensive. Like, that's kind of all you need to know at this point, really. Uh... This is this is a bit shocking to see from Michigan State. You know, I, we thought there would be a decline this year with what they lost from last year's team, but this is way worse than we expect. Uh, Penn State is going to try and run the ball. Obviously, they're going to try and establish the run. They will be able to do that. They're number 44 in rushing success rate on offense. Michigan State is number 92 on defense. Uh, PPA per rush, Penn State number 28, and Michigan State's defense is number 74. This Michigan State defense, even if you had to try and pass the ball on them, say that they are able to finally get some stops because Honestly, they haven't been able to. Standard down PPA defense for Michigan State is number 87. For Penn State, it's number 22. This is a disaster. Just a complete disaster. Uh, Penn State will be able to score almost whatever they want to uh, on Michigan State, it does appear. Michigan State is number 100 in PPA per pass. I I look at passing downs PPA, even if you get Penn State into third and long, etc., second and long, put them behind the chains, it's not going to matter. Because Michigan State's defense is number 83 in passing down success rate. And Penn State is number 42 on offense. Penn State's number 30 in passing down PPA on offense. Michigan State's number 99. Like, this Michigan State defense is bad. And then you start to look at the offense. They can't run the ball. And not only that, they're still trying to do that. They're still running the ball about 50% of the time. They're number 119 in rushing success rate over the last five weeks. Penn State's defense is number 13. They are number 117 in PPA per rush on offense is Michigan State. Penn State's defense is number 8. Like, Penn State is number 1 in stuff rate over the past five weeks. Michigan State's offense is number 113 in allowing it. This is a disaster. Uh, But James Franklin has this team absolutely rolling right now. They are still fighting for a New Year's Six berth. They, they're they looking at a 10th win for the first time in, in quite a while. I think they're going to go out and they're going to put everything they can on Michigan State here. Give me Penn State minus the 18. I, yeah, that is, that's a rough one. That's a rough one. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and subscribe on YouTube or your favorite podcast app. And make sure to leave a nice five-star review. You can follow Gary on Twitter at GaryWCE. And the show is at Winning Cures. Be sure to check out the merch in our web store and share the show.